Good, good evening. It is still Monday. Um, you know, typical Monday. So, uh, actually, I had a pretty busy morning when I first got here. Uh, I wasn't here on Sunday. I actually spent the day with the family. Had a great time. Went and saw the Atlanta Symphony, Symphony Orchestra. I can't say that. Uh, and it was, uh, they played John Williams. And, uh, of course, everybody knows John Williams and Star Wars. But they played a lot of his other big um, movie themes. Um, I will say they missed my favorites. They didn't play my favorite, but, uh, you know, um, probably a good thing. Everybody was having fun. My favorite is Schindler, Schindler's List, the theme. But, uh, yeah, it's kind of a downer. So probably uh, not the best thing to play uh, when you're <laughs> trying to have fun. But anyway, but yeah, it was a good time with the family. Went ahead, ate uh, in places crust and Alpharetta. And uh, had some great, uh, had a calzone. But all the family's food, it was... Outstanding. Um, so definitely be going back there to eat. And yeah, we uh, I like going to the symphony. Uh, when we were out in Los Angeles, we actually had uh, tickets to the Hollywood Bowl. Saw some great concerts there. And also the Disney, I forget what it's called. I had tickets to the symphony in Los Angeles. Um, and the symphony hall there was was incredible um i mean you can hear a, truly hear a pin drop in that place but uh have fun doing that stuff um thanks to the wife he's kind of her um belated mother's day birthday presents so anyway thanks to her it was a good time so uh what's going on what's going on Got uh, monument paint in today. Uh, still going through monument paint. Good stuff. Um, yeah, I'm painting some stuff and going to be doing some bright. Uh, got the com uh, cyberpunk combat red stuff. Yeah, there's not so going to focus. Anyway, I'm going to try to paint some really bright stuff. Going to pretty much use a pro acryl. As a base, and probably try what I've been doing, going over it with some uh, contrast for the shading and uh, highlighting. We'll see how that goes. Got my first set of horses done today, so yeah, productive day. Um, back to Cyberpunk uh, Combat Zone. Um, Chris got me game in the other day, and I been watching it ever since the kickstarter uh, i will be honest the kickstarter actually turned me off from the game initially one thing was kickstarter and then their their videos i'd say it were not good videos on the how to play and this stuff so yeah i was like uh i'll wait for it to come out um monster fight club which is a, a solid uh company uh, producing games and stuff when they they released it retail. Still didn't pick it up. Several guys got it, been playing. Uh, I've watched some new videos on it, and I was like, no, I, I think I'd like the mechanics, like the game, like the theme of the game. So, yeah, I finally got Chris to get me a game in Friday, and I liked it. Um, skirmish, uh, as I said several times on here, um, Elder, you get less miniatures. Um, yeah, it, I like it. We play, I guess, about six miniatures, six to eight miniatures, what you play with, depending on the size of the game. Uh, small table, you get right into fighting. Uh, cool mechanic of it is uh, you don't have turns. Um, each character, each model has... Right now, I guess two to three actions. You can use those actions. You save the actions. You do one, go 
you know, but you you take turns, which I like. Um, so you're very reactive. You can also, if they, you can react when they you get shot. And once again, I like being able to react. But uh, then you decide when you want to. Uh, I forget what the, their term is, but refresh, and you reset all your activations. So it's a little bit of almost push your luck. Um, I'll, I'll use all my activations or do I want to reset and be ready to do stuff. Um, so I like that. So yeah, I'm, I'm painting up some guys for it. Um, what else we got going on? Uh, that's some new we got, and I've got to order some more. I didn't order enough. Marvel Crisis Protocol. I uh, had a nice 40K tournament um, on Saturday. Had I think 20 people register. I had 18 people playing. So good turnout. That's once I've mentioned it before. Also, it's a good group of guys uh, having fun, uh, you know, just sitting here watching. Uh, no issues. It's, it's just it's fun, fun to see people having fun. Yeah. Um, so good stuff. Um, got a lot of interest in Legion, so maybe trying to see if we can get that on the table a little more. Um, once again, it's it's a it's a solid game. I personally, I'm like. Mike, I have to agree with Mike for once. Um, I like playing more simple games of Legion. Uh, it can get, I don't say too much, but there's a lot of cards you add on, special abilities and stuff. And you know, my problem is I don't play enough of those games to remember to use my special ability and then and or even know what it's best for. So, um, yeah, solid game. Um, I think it does. Um, what's the word I'm home for? Don't put your hand in front of your face when you're talking. Uh, um, meets the theme of Star Wars. So I like that. Um, so what else? We... Uh, of course, I was going to say something. What I get for doing these late at night, uh, at least when I do them in the morning, I'm fresh and my brain is going uh, late. It's store is closed, so 10 o'clock. My brain sometimes uh, uh, doesn't work so well. So um, I was going to talk about 3D printers. I got like, bamboo printers down. I had a clog. Filament cleared that, which took forever. I had to take the, the extruder totally apart, and then still it was a pain. So first major issue I've had with the bamboo. But now I've got a, uh, a hot end heating fan error. Um, could be several things. Uh, tomorrow I think I'm going to take the fan off the one bamboo, put it on the other, and... Uh, if that's the fixes, I order some new parts. Good thing about the bamboo, very modular, um, and parts once again, not as cheap as the Ender, but I say I buy the whole hot end fan assembly, and uh, I don't know, it's 20 bucks. So, but yeah, it got to be once again the right frame of mind to mess with 3D printers, and hopefully tomorrow afternoon I'll get to that. Um, printing, print out some people dice towers. Got one sitting here. Oop, oop. I've got a couple bigger ones I want to print out. Um, but that's just cool. That oh, there's a hole. Once again, these are not made for um, what I'm think for 40k. Uh, so I've got to clean up some a little bit. Of, they're made for role playing. Uh, only one die size time, so but they're cool. Uh, what else we got going? 
Um, I think we'll try to have a big game of heat this Friday. I need to work on trying to get some players. That's a, a racing game, uh, super popular. That I mean, they're selling out of their copies. That's through Ozma Day. Um, about as fast as I can get them. I know I've already got some on order again because they're sold out again. So we'll hopefully have some fun with that with Corey on, on Friday. Um, oh, I've got my list of, i got to add Millennium Con. Do you have my list of conventions 90% done? Um, I need to make sure I got those dates cleared up. Hotels. Signed up for a booth. Uh, I need, I want to start now thinking about what we're going to take. Um, so, yeah, a lot of thought goes into going to the conventions. Everyone's different. Every convention is different. Uh, never take the same thing. Uh, but, uh, and I think that's the key for me um, as, a, as a shop is taking the right items depending on kind of the clientele of the convention. So I'll, I'm going to start thinking through that. Um, speaking of, i uh, been doing well with Oz, Wars of Oz. I want to get another couple of units painted. And Russ has some new stuff coming out very soon. Buck's done some beta um copies beta writing of the faction list for those so it'd be fun to to get some of that stuff on the table and like i said i, I want to get some a couple more units painted up for that so yeah i got i'm actually got a, some painting projects so i gotta keep, keep on it keep my act together and try to paint a little bit every day Uh, what else do I have? Um, yeah, I was supposed to play um, Bushido with uh, Steven today, but that, yeah, my 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 day didn't work out. So we're gonna try again next Monday. We might make that a Monday regular thing. Get some games in of that. Um, I still have free blade sitting here on my desk. Um, I love that game. Uh, I've got to get once again uh, find a couple of people to get that on the table uh, with me. Um, one of my favorite skirmish games, especially if you're running a campaign, it's awesome. What else? We'll probably maybe try some blackout again. Tuesday, not sure. Um, had a great game of Lobotomy last Tuesday. We won the scenario. One of the few times we won. Of course, that leads me to believe we probably cheated some. Not intentionally. Uh, but, um, yeah, you you don't win very often in that game. So, But we did, and uh, that was fun. Had a good time. With uh, Eric and Glenda. Um, see what else we got going. There's, I'm sure there's something I'm missing. Uh, I'm not sure what, what Ashley Mike. He said he's got a lot of games running uh, Wednesday and Thursday, but you know me, I forgot to ask what he was going to be running. Uh, he's definitely pushing Baron's Rule War. Uh, that's a firelock game. Not Baron's Rule. Like said, getting old, getting slow. Um, same time period, but Blood and Crowns. That's it. Yeah, yay. Get it right here. Uh, Blood and Crowns. Uh, once again, Firelock series of games. Good stuff. Also, Fire and Ice, him and Thomas got a game of Fire and Ice in. Um, that's what we're supposed to. That was it. He got me my cart. I knew if I him hauled around enough. Um, he's supposed to, I guess Wednesday, we're supposed to, or is it tomorrow? I have to message him. Anyway, I get a game of Fire and Ice in. Back when we first opened the store, seven years ago, the game first out, 
first came out. Um, got some games in. It was one of the, the games me and Troy played when no one else was around um, and had a pretty good time. with. I got a full painted army, so why not play something I don't have to paint? Problem is there's a bunch of expansions, so I'll probably want to get them and paint some more. So, yeah, I'm like uh, everybody else. That list of planning gets uh, very long. The more I talk, the more I think, the more stuff I got to paint. Um, I mean, the wife trimmed the beard pretty good. Um, I need to brush it. Anyway, <laughs> that's a, yeah, like I said, late on, uh, late night, my mind kind of wonders. Um, but anyway. So, yeah, we're going to get some fire and ice in this week and have fun. Um, think, yeah, that was definitely the game I was thinking about that uh, we were going to get on the table. So, well, with that, it is after 10 o'clock. I think I'm going to wander home and um, probably read, do some reading. I've been doing that when I get home to... Relax. Only problem is, like I said, at night, I, I don't remember much what I, I read. But anyway, that's all good. So I uh, hope everybody has uh, a great week. And uh, I guess we'll talk to you next time.